हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट एस अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट की बोर्ड की बोर्ड इज एन इनपुट डिवाइस फॉर यूजर इंटरफेस सो टू एंटर एनी आल्फा न्यूमरिकल इनपुट विल यूज की बोर्ड इफ द नंबर ऑफ कीस आर वेरी लेस एट दैट केस वी कैन यूज पुश बटन स्विच because this push button switch can be directly interfaced with the port pin of the microprocessor or microcontroller if the number of keys required are more at that case we can use keyboard as input device because for more number of keys if we use push button it may not be possible to interface each key to the port pin due to limited number of general purpose port pins that are available in microprocessor or controller so if number of keys that are required to enter the input are more at that case matrix keyboard is better option so matrix keyboard will generally reduces the number of interface requirement for example to interface 16 keys we require 16 ports of microprocessor or microcontroller but if we use matrix keyboard to interface 16 keys we require only 8 ports hence it reduces the number of interface requirement the 16 keys are arranged in the form of matrix which consist of four rows and four columns as shown in this figure so in keyboard 16 keys are arranged in four column and four rows matrix as shown in this figure in matrix keyboard keys are arranged in the form of matrix to detect a key pressed the keyboard uses scanning technique so keyboard uses scanning technique to detect the key that is pressed here each row of matrix is pulled low and columns are read after reading the status of each column corresponding to row the row is pulled high and next row is pulled low and the status of column are red this process is repeated until each row is scanned now let us understand how this keys are scanned in keyboard so as we have seen here all the rows are made zero so all the rows will be made zero initially and since each column are connected to vcc so these columns will be having value as 1 now let us say this key is pressed so since this key is pressed on this column line we are having 1 and on this row line we are having 0 correspondingly this column which is column number 1 will become 0 because these two lines are shorted now since column 1 is 0 the controller will understand that the keys which are in column 1 is pressed but now we need to identify which key has been pressed to understand that each row is made as 1 except for one row and status of each column is checked that will remain one itself now second row is made as 0 and first row is made as 1 when second row is made as 0 correspondingly the column 1 will become 0 which identifies that the key which is related with row 1 and column 1 is pressed and a particular key that is pressed is identified so this is the working of keypad hope you have understood this topic Thank you